Uh, so Mickey, exiting the Papa John's Trophy, give us your thoughts. Um, really, really, I mean, it's an underestimation to say disappointed because we had enough chances to win many, many games. And yet, you, if you're going to win games like this, then you must take the opportunities you've you just got to. That's not criticism, that's just the facts of football. But the amount of clear-cut chances we had and, and didn't go and finish the game off, you're always liable to maybe give something away when, when, when teams are playing against you and throwing a wee bit of caution to the wind. Something like that might happen. But leading up to the, the equaliser again, I, I thought I, I, th I thought the referee was horrendous. I thought it was horrendous. Um, we have a, cl a clear and blatant foul on the halfway line. When Kane's running through and goal, we get that free kick. We go and play the last one or two minutes in, in, uh, in the attacking half. But he doesn't even give us a foul for it. And then um, they end up with a corner. And we believe that he was offside from um, the, the, the goal anyway, the, 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 the guy who scored the goal. So you're at the mercy of these people a lot of the time. And I know that that's... That's the way it goes. Sometimes you go to say that that's football, but it, it's, 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 got to, it's got to get better. It's got to get better. Um, but on performance-wise, um, the players were, were, were fabulous. I thought we, we were very, very good all evening. Played some great football, created some unbelievable chances, like, like I say, that we've got to take. The fans that, that, that came down were, were excellent as well. And it was... Um, a real harsh one. I, I, I would have to be honest and say I don't think. I think that um, Bottom can will count themselves very, very fortunate to to uh, still be in a, in a trophy, and that's that's me being on, being blatantly honest. Yeah, and that goal right at the end obviously it looked quite scrappy from where I was. Sat. What, what, what was your assessment of it? We get an opportunity to head it clear, and we don't we don't head it well. We sort of head it up near. But then as we're coming out, they leave two around about the goalkeeper and when it comes in, the, the two of them are still in, in, in offside positions um, from an overhead kick. Um, so that, that goes against us. But before that, we were, at the, we were at the mercy of a decision by the referee. So that has nothing to do with the players. But like I say, the performance all evening was, was, was super. Um, they showed what qualities that they have. And uh, the, the, the performance is the positive from that we, we that we showed tonight we were capable of. Yeah, definitely. And how difficult is it going to be to sort of keep hold of those positives even though you've come away with a loss here? Well, we've drawn a game and lost a penalty shootout. It won't be difficult at all because the performance was, was there for everybody to see. Um, so we'll just... Uh, get in next week and try and keep the standards high and keep uh, us performing the way that we performed this evening more and most of the time. Yeah, and after Saturday's game, Derek asked you about how you were starting games and obviously a fantastic start to this one here. Yeah, well, we started it very well this, this, this evening. Um, what I didn't want to happen was that we, we, we sort of put two or three bad starts into a whole season and it's not been like that. Mm. So I couldn't allow that to, to, to be put against us. But certainly this evening we started really well and, and should have scored uh, a couple of goals really early. Um, so no, well, the, 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 the boys performed really well. Yeah, and the full-backs again, you've said so many times about how much quality they have and they really, really showed that tonight. Yeah, not just them, I think the whole, through the whole team I thought that we showed all the qualities that, that, that we have. The frustrating thing is, is that you want, you need to see that all the time. Sometimes we we, we don't do that. But I, young, you're a, a very young side, as we keep on saying. But and they will learn that, that, that we have to start games like we did this evening to give ourselves a good opportunity. But they'll also learn that when the chances come, you must be you must be clinical um, and take them and go and win games of football. Yeah, and playing a team a league above as well, showing that kind of performance against a team a tier above you yeah. must be really good for you. Well, we're disappointed we've lost mm, in a penalty exactly. shoot. But certainly in terms of performance, I think there was only one team that looked that deserved to get the result. And that's and I would always be respectful of everything we play against, but I'll also be very, very honest. But we've got to take the chances. If we're going to win games of football, we must take the chances that, that came our way. And we, we didn't do that, so we, we ran the risk of what happened at the end. Yeah, now a week and a half until Northampton away now. Uh, what's your plans for the next 10 days? 
just keep working with the, with the group, keep practicing being a good good side uh, and keep the group moving forward. Yeah, and Hodgie, he announced that he's leaving today. Got a final message to him as he leaves for Blackpool? Oh, no, we're, we're, we're um, obviously disappointed to, to, to lose him. Um, but he wanted to go and that's the way that things happen. But Mark's ready to step in now. We, we have contingency plans here anyway, so Mark will step in and he, he knows the job well, so away he'll go with things now.